I will teach you a foam-free technique that's super versatile. So I'm just gonna roll it up. I'm gonna squeeze it in. Now foxgloves are truly my favorite flower. Here you can see there's pink and purple, dainty, delicate little flowers with great movements. Just cover a bit of the base. So it would look like it's spilling out like watercolor almost. You don't want straight lines, you want it to be more natural. Like it's actually growing from my table. So don't go overstuffing it right away to cover up all the things. You're covering up as you go. And then we'll pick up the tones of the rest of my color palette. This is definitely not a minimal arrangement. You really can discover some hidden treasures. It's just like in real life. If you pay more attention, you will see more things. And you can walk down the same street every single day. But if you pay attention, you can find something new every single day. So I'm adding in this, um, <laughs> this mossy uh, block we made in the beginning. And this is a great way to use your entire stem. Too beautiful not to use. Actually, I really like the look of this. It feels like fairy dust. So it really highlights this darker area. But some people want to see and talk to each other. I don't know. <laughs> I'm good with the flowers. So you can easily build outwards and upwards with this. And you can replace pretty much any flower I've used today with any flower that's available near you. 